poop, and that's no lie, cause when I eat poop, I catch E. coli, and E. coli just ain't no fun, no, I don't like poop, well, I won't drink pee, that's just me, I'd rather have a nice cup of hot tea, now El Nino filled the sea with pee pee, and I don't like pee, and I'm not lying, I don't like pee, oh yeah, I don't, no, I don't like pee. Somebody told me that the that the date of a toilet's production was. <clears throat> Dang! Look at it. it's got all messed up. There it is. I think that's 1928. I kind of I kind of look at a lot of things that that seem like they would just be you know garbage now, like newspapers you know, but you add 20 years and then you add 50 years and they become very interesting. It just like certain piles of boxes represent like a different era in my life. I started playing the ukulele after a trip to Hawaii in, uh, about 10 years ago, and I had uh, I just bit, I was in the middle of a breakup with a girlfriend, and I just wanted to leave LA for a while and just get out and clear my head. And I met this uh, guy selling shirts at a crafts fair, and while he was waiting for customers, he was just sort of like sitting there plucking away at his ukulele. <clears throat> and I started talking to him, and he let me try it out, and I got sort of like bit by the bug. Don't forget the ginkgo. And I also got hooked on the idea of traveling, so I started planning a longer trip around the world, and I was thinking I'm gonna need to make some money on the way, because I didn't have that kind of money to do it all. So I brought the ukulele and a hat and a, and a guitar, and I started playing on the streets. And, and slowly, in the year 1994, I started developing more of, a, of an act. I need a girlfriend, and I'm saying, I, I don't say I need a girlfriend because I would put all this work on anybody, but it would either be motivating to get me to clean up this place, or it would be helpful because I'd have somebody else there just like pitching in. This is where I sleep, believe it or not. You know, it's not easy having a round bed. Mm -hmm. it's, very, it's very disorienting too when you're asleep and you wake up, you're like, ah! B is for beautiful, you know you are I is for incredible my incredible darling T is for terrific because you're so terrific and C is for caring loving and caring H is for heavenly my heavenly angel you my bitch you my bitch you my bitch this is a uh, this is a, a war club, and this was on my uh, this was on my wall as a kid at, at my mom and dad's house. Wood carvings. That's that's what I'm collecting. Quan Quan has imported this genuine Mexican wife beater. I trained at the Groundlings. I studied improvisation, and so when I when I perform in front of an audience, I, I interact and. Um, sort of deal with a lot of what's going on and improvise songs and just have a good time. <laughs> you trying to do that? You trying to make my mess? You're trying to? You're gonna mess up my feng shui. Weird TV.